welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone is having a great day. Uh, I'll go ahead and start. I tried filming this video twice and uh, we are having storms that are approaching so I will say the light may cut in and out. Uh, <laughs> I don't have any fancy filming equipment, so that's just kind of the way it goes. I do fr film in front of a window, and so that will happen from time to time. So I apologize for that up front. Uh, next, I will say this video is a empties video. And what I have in this bag are products that I've used up throughout this month. It may be a June-July combo, but whenever I get a bag filled, I will uh, review the products that I've used. And I think that it gives a great idea of how I feel about these products. I've completely used them. Some of these are samples, so uh, keep that in mind that uh, you know, you can get somewhat of a good opinion about samples, but I think when you use full-size products, you get a better about how the product actually works. But uh, with that said, we'll go ahead and get started. These are two of my full-size items that I have. This is by the Acure brand and I absolutely love this brand. Pretty much everything that I have in my bathroom I'm switching over. So therefore if it falls into the category line of shampoo, conditioners, body washes, soaps, moisturizers for your face, body that moisturizers. I, really love, I haven't found anything I don't love so far from the Acure brand that is what I'm switching over to. These happen to be the uh, lemongrass and argon stem cell. This is the uh, keratin boosting complex the everyday clarifying shampoo and conditioner is for all hair types it also says that it's color treated um, I occasionally do color my hair but it's so close to my natural color it's it's only meant to cover the grays so <laughs> uh, that's our little secret girls um, so just to let you guys know but I love these uh, or I should say I love this brand just because of it being environmentally safe, cruelty-free, gluten-free, which if you guys watch my channel and you're probably here because of that factor, I am 100% gluten-free and I've never had an issue with these uh, any of the products that I've tried from this brand. And they're also free from most of your toxins that you're trying to avoid, phthalates and uh, parabens that you want to avoid in your products that you're using that are known to be hormone imbalancing or cancer causing so uh, I can't say enough about this I love the smell of lemongrass I drink lemongrass tea not associated with the empties here I don't have any of that but uh, I just love that smell so if you like that smell this is so true to that and it performs really well and um, I do have I do have another shampoo in my backup but I have found that I really like the uh, Moroccan uh, stem cell is it Moroccan argon stem cell, the shampoo. Um, just to let you guys know, I will link a video of anything that I reference here down in the bottom or it will be a pop-up here on the top. But I bought uh, my last Cure Haul the huge sizes of those shampoos and conditioners. So I'm going to use those for a while um, and then maybe using the uh, the shampoo every once in a while as a clarifier just to uh, I, I say detox my hair, so uh, sorry so long on uh, that. The next time that I have, you guys, this is, there's a light. I'm going to say I apologize again. Um, there we go. This is the uh, Desert Essence, the Natural Tea Tree Oil Ultra Care Toothpaste Mega Mint. I get this off of Vitacost, and um, I will also, there's always a code down the bottom that if you're new to Vitacost, you can save $10 off of your, I think it's $30 order, and I will be upfront about that. It is a referral code, so if you use that code, I will also get $10, but I shop there. Watch my past videos. You guys know I shop there regardless. Sign up for their emails because you'll get like deals. They usually have 12% off or 10% off. Um, different when holidays come up they have holiday sales or they just have buy one get one of uh, Vitacost so it's just a great place to shop if you're looking for any natural cruelty free there's a bar on the side that you can actually um, uh, do searches for uh, if you're looking for uh, specific factors in shopping for items but I gluten-free products that is my go-to because in town and pretty much you guys know if you're shopping gluten-free things they are expensive and when I can save and if I can help you guys save I'm gonna do that but this toothpaste I love it it's minty it does the job I don't know what number of tube I am on but it's we all use it in our household and there's four it's my husband and two boys and this is a go-to and I do switch between tea tree oil and not tea tree oil so that will vary but Desert Essence is the brand that I choose and really like that and we have great dental records just to, just to let you guys know that 
Uh, the Everyone Face for Everyday Moisturizer. I really like this product. However, I am using a Cure uh, nail, but I love the smell of this. It did really great. It was very moisturizing without being overly moisturizing because I've mentioned in past videos, my skin can go anywhere from dry in the winter here in Minnesota, where it's extremely arid, to it's been humid the last couple weeks here, so my face has been overly uh, producing of oil. TMI, I don't know, but uh, yeah, it fluctuates. I can't really say I have normal. I pretty much have combo, so it goes between dry, combo, oily, but this worked really well. I used this for quite a while, and uh, if I was looking for something, I would repurchase this, but uh, I don't know. There is going to be a glare, guys, so there's not really... I'll reference the product. There might be a better um, way for you guys to see this, but again, it's the Everyone Face for Everyday uh, Moisturizer, so really like that. Uh, Andalou Naturals, I really liked this cleanser. This was the Meyer Creamy Cleanser, but I found that, again, I like the Acure brand much better. Um, this is the brightening. I didn't find that it did very much brightening. I don't know. It says Renew, Repair, Regenerate. I don't think it did any repairing. I had sunspots. I didn't see that fading with this product at all. Uh, I do have the Vitamin C um, Serum that I really like, and that does, if, if I use it consistently, I will see some fading, but Sometimes I don't do that, you know, I'm a mom, it gets busy, so yeah, I'm just going to admit it, it is what it is, right? But I did like the smell of this, I love citrus smells, I love the smell of lemon, that has to be my favorite smell ever, but uh, this I probably will not, I don't know, I, I might repurchase it, I would repurchase it, but I just found other things that I kind of like better, so just so you guys know. The Derma E Anti-Wrinkle Vitamin A Glycolic Cleanser. This has uh, papaya. It's naturally exfoliating formula and sulfate-free. This was uh, from normal to oily. I didn't really care for this. It was, an, if I remember correctly, it was an, oh, yeah, okay smell. A little more floral. I don't know. It just, it, it didn't float my boat or, yeah, do anything. Yeah, it, it just didn't wow me. So, yeah, I won't repurchase that. Uh, this is what started it all. This was a sample that I got from Acure, the Deluxe Size Samples. This is the shampoo, the Moroccan Argan, the Moroccan Argan Stem Cell and Argan Oil. This is what I tried. I, I tried every Acure shampoo. I either liked them or did not like them. The uh, Mint and Echinacea, which was for fine hair. For some reason, I have fine hair. I have a lot of hair, but I didn't find that that worked really well for me. And I never considered this because it stated for curly hair or coarse hair or something like that. And I thought, well, I don't have that. That's not going to work for me, but I love this. Anyway, remember, I will link all that information up here, down here, somewhere. But I really like this. I have, um, I think, two shampoos. Or no, I have one backup normal 8 ounce. I think it's 8 ounce. Uh, yes, eight ounce, this size in the Moroccan. And then I bought the big ones. I absolutely love this. So sometimes when you think something's not going to work, it may be your best friend. So just saying that, but absolutely love that. Love the smell. It has the almond cookies. That's kind of what it reminds me of. And I, it does function very well. So I will say, Acure says it doesn't have to be natural, but it has to work. That product works. It's amazing. Love that. Uh, just some things that I'm passing on. This is uh, Essie Nail Polish. I am trying to phase out. I have a ton of nail polishes. I collect them. I don't usually wear them on my fingers, but I pretty much have my toes painted all the time. These colors I bought, this was in the uh, Absolutely Sure, and this was in the color. This was like a special deal that I got off of Amazon. It was like the five, I don't even know, was it Spring 14 colors? Uh, but this was a crude interest and this was kind of like a peachy color and this is a mint These didn't do anything really work for me. I didn't care for the colors I like most of the Essie formulas, but I'm switching over to Zoya So um, I will have a huge Zoya haul coming up you guys. I went I was bad Earth Day um, The July sale I'm trying to think of another sale they just had but uh, yeah pretty bad, but I love their polishes. They don't claim to be gluten-free, but I have never had an issue with that. So um, just letting you guys know. Uh, one of the items, a personal care item, this is a razor. I use this to um, trim up my eyebrows and kind of get rid of the hair in between the eyebrows and also um, 
ladies, if you have this issue, if you tend to get a little peach fuzz above your upper lip or anywhere under your chin, I'm over 40, so yeah. Mm. Welcome to uh, adulthood, I guess, uh, maturing, whatever you want to call it. But this works really well just to uh, just kind of zip those um, little hairs off without using an actual razor. So it's kind of a little more dainty, I would say. So if you have this in your cosmetic bag, then uh, if you have any questions, you can actually let someone know versus if you have a razor. Just a little helpful information. Uh, something that I finished up was the Acure face mask. Was, this was another sample. I think most of the items that I have now are samples that I got in that last um, in that last Acure haul. And so I really like this face mask, and I will definitely be repurchasing this. It left my face feeling very clean, detoxed. Um, it was clear, just amazing. And let's see the next items. I'm the sun is not cooperating, so I'm just going to pull these all out of the. Um, these are all Acure samples that I got in that last Acure haul, and I will let you guys know. This is the Acure Fragrance Free Sensitive Facial uh, Cream. I liked this. There was no fragrance, so I didn't have to worry about anything um, irritating my skin. This had argon oil and probiotic. It was for dry, sensitive skin. Uh, I didn't find it over moisturizing, so you know I think you could use it in the summer. I that's when I was using. I got these samples and I used this and I didn't have any issues, so I really like that. This is a lilac stem cell chlorella growth factor, the oil control face facial moisturizer. I really like this. I did purchase a full size in that. Uh, this was the pure mint and echinacea stem cell with quinoa protein. Bab Basu oil. It says intense volume for normal to fine lip hair. I did use these just to see if the sample, sometimes samples perform a little differently than a full size, but yeah, again, this just did not work for me. So um, even though I love a cure shampoos, it's kind of weird. Like I said, I have fine hair and it does not, it does not have a lot of body. So you would think that this would be my ideal match, but like I said, uh, I'm going to pick this up. The Moroccan Argon Stem Cell and Argon Oil, the conditioner and the shampoo that is supposed to be for coarse or curly hair. This is my favorite versus this. So uh, don't be afraid to try different things out and see how it goes for you. You may be surprised. Uh, this is the uh, cleansing gel, the facial cleanser, super fruit and chlorella growth factor. I really love this. Uh, I actually have one of these. Oh, sorry. I actually did pick this up in a full size, and so I love this. This will be in my bathroom for quite a while, and uh, it performs very well. The Advanced Triple Moisture System Body Lotion. This is the Mandarin Orange and Moroccan Argon Stem Cell. Um, I did not think that this smelled as much of a citrus smell as I was expecting. I was hoping that it would have been a little more orange smelling. I know that Mandarin is a sweeter orange, but um, it kind of wasn't what I was going for. The triple moisture that really worked a little more than what I need in the summertime but maybe in the winter when I'm dealing with a uh, drier skin then I will pick this up but for now it's something that's kind of on the back burner. Uh, the body wash this is the Moroccan Argon Stem Cell Argon Oil Cell Stimulating Body Wash with Sea Buckthorn and CoQ10. I really like the Sea Buckthorn. Um, I featured that in past Vitacost hauls that I picked up from Vitacost. That was a serum that you would use on your face. It's really great for cell turnover, for acne sensitive prone skin. And then the CoQ10, I believe, is also something that helps with anti aging. Um, trying to think. I think this worked really well. I, it's, uh, I like their. What is it? The big mint that I just picked up, the clarifying um, body wash. I really like that. This one I might pick up next. I'm not sure. It's it is something that I would re, I would purchase, but uh, kind of again on the back burner. Then I have the Argyle Plus Mint Facial Cleansing Cream. This is for normal to dry skin. Really love this. It is. It says a cleansing cream, but I did notice that once you I, I kind of dab it on my face, spread it on. Uh, kind of work it in and then when you apply water it does kind of have a little bit of a foaming action I didn't know that and so I really like this and I will be repurchasing this again I have a full-size nail and uh, yeah this will be in my basket for future purchases and then I have the lemon probiotic chlorella growth factor radical resurfacing even skin tone 
photo damage, all skin types. This is a sample. I want to pick up a full size of this and give this a try. Like I said, I use the Angelou Naturals, the vitamin C serum, and that is supposed to help with the fading of the um, uh, sunspots. But I love lemon. That's one of the pluses for this. And believe it or not, this is radical resurfacing. So you can put this on then apply anything, moisturizer, makeup, whatever on top. And I really like that. Whereas I find with the vitamin C, it can be a little irritating for my skin, the one from Angelou Naturals. And so I don't like to wear that out in the sun. Um, it's more of a nighttime thing. And so I think I'm going to pick this up and uh, give this a try uh, once I'm done with that vitamin C from Angelou Naturals. And I think I'm really going to like this. So uh, that is it for my empties. I hope there was something that you guys found. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comment. Like I said, anything that's mentioned in the video that may have another link to it, it will be in a pop-up here or listed down below. I hope everyone has a wonderful day today, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.